the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. And for this video, I'm going to show you how to get the new sword, Kyoru. For the first requirement, you need to get max level 3300 in this update. So first off, you need to level up fast. Where can you level up fast? As I suggest go to the Skull Island. This is where we're heading at right now. There you go. So you need to defeat the Elite Skeleton. Why that gamer nom? It's because it's so fast. Focus on the experience gauge. There you go. As you can see, we're level 3200, right? We're about to level up. One more thing. This is very easy to defeat. Not like the first set of mobs in the Loaf Island. Yes. We're gonna skip a quest there because you need to defeat four of those mobs. And I don't want luring. See that, guys? We just leveled up and now we're about to level up again. There you go, guys. Do this until you reach 3200. 25 but to be honest the way how fast our leveling up is it is safe to say that you can stay in here until you reach 3250 okay so there you go when we reach level 3225 we are heading to the love island and it is located here just to the right of the skull island there you go okay and if you're watching one piece this is the island of big mom one of the yonkus Okay, so now you need to start defeating the sunken vessel. It's located here. Is it easy to defeat? Yes. Again, single target mobs. Very it's easy to level up with. As if you want to defeat this faster, just go on top of that rock there or that wall. Yeah, that broken wall. I'm gonna show it to you later. We're gonna level up here until you reach level 3250 only 25 levels and it really is easy okay here guys this is what I'm telling on top of this wall there you go easy okay so after that just head to this mountain and you can start defeating your 3250 quest the biscuit man guys there's a drop in the sunken vessel a sword I'm gonna showcase that later or maybe tomorrow once I've completed all the accessories and the new swords. Next up guys, Biscuit Man. I think there are two drops here. Again, I'm gonna showcase all of those when I unlock them. If you're wondering, our goal level here is 3,275 or 3,270 because that's the requirement to fight Do Man Katakuri. Is it easy? To be honest, no. You need a technique or strategy to be able to defeat him one on one. I think I will be able to show you one strategy. Okay, so here we go. Oh, it's 1275. So he's located here. The quest giver is located in front of the castle. We're heading towards it now. So guys, did you watch the fight of Luffy and Katakori in One Piece? Uh, it really looks cool. I suggest you watch it. So he's located here. Okay, in the mirror. There you go. Gamer is there a way to defeat him easily? If you're planning on like using long range attacks, that won't matter. The range of this mob is so far that even if you like fly into the ceiling, you will still get hit. I'm gonna show it to you. Okay, see that guys? I'm running here. I thought I'm safe, right? I even used my observation hockey. Okay. So now I'm thinking of a way to defeat him, but suddenly he attacked me. See that guys? That's so far. Check that range. Oh, I'm in the ceiling right now. Boom. <laughs> okay, we just died. Gamer, is there an easy way? Hmm. Two things. You need to burst him or after you burst him with your skills, most likely he's not yet dead. Go outside the mirror, recharge your skills, and then after that, go back to him. And you can also get some accessories from him. I think the sword, the trident, and the scarf. As you can see what I'm wearing, the blue scarf. I defeated this mob until I reach max level here. Why? Because I wanted to unlock the trident and the blue scarf. But you don't need to level up here until you reach 3,300. It's just that I want to get those items. 
I'm again you can go back to the biscuit man or the sunken vessel or even in the elite skeleton just to level up faster okay so now when you reach level 3300 you can now start your quest to get the Kyoru so in the spawn point of this island you can talk to tiger here it is he will give you some quests so for the first quest you need to defeat Kappa he is located in the Veridans so from the port just go straight go they changed the map that's why some of the players are confused that's why I'm showing it and there you go here you go Veridans and Kappa is located here he is easy to defeat given that his level is very low there you go just defeat him fast and after this just reset go back to tiger and next he will ask you to defeat Anubis okay, so where is Anubis located if you're not aware just go right from the Loaf Island and you will find the island where Anubis is located go the dead tundra so Anubis is he easy to defeat yes just dodge the skills and there will be no problems oh if just in case you don't know you can get an Anubis sword here he's dead go back to tiger next quest is the flame user and he is also located here in the dead tundra I just avoid getting hit by the skills of this because this mob can burst you so make sure to always activate your observation hockey okay see that Go back to Tiger again, and he will ask you to defeat the sunken vessel. We defeated this a while ago, so this will be easy again. Okay, next up, go back to the Tiger. He will ask you to defeat Biscuit Man. Yes. We're almost done with the quest. After this, Tiger will ask you to defeat the Dome Master. Again, guys, if you're having a hard time, just ask your friends. Or maybe in the public server. There you go. Dome Master. Guys, for example, if he asks you to defeat Dome Master, don't get the quest of the Dome Master, okay? Just defeat it. Okay, so now, after that, go to Tiger. And he will thank you. And ask you if you want to buy the Kyoru. The Kyoru is worth 25 million belly. Make sure you have that. I appreciate the support. Blah, blah. So here is the sword, guys. This sword has two skills. We're gonna try it. That's the first one, the radio slash, and next one is the injection slash. There you go. I think this is a long range attack. Ooh. But the damage is not that high. So if you're gonna ask me, authentic triple katana or this one? Hmm. I will still go for the authentic triple katana. Okay? Okay guys, so that's it for the video. I'm still trying to unlock all the skills. I'm grinding gem for the bomb fruit as well as the quake fruit. So better watch out for that. I'm also planning to make a noob to one level using the spirit fruit. So again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. See you later on my next video guys. This is GamerNom. GamerNom out.